going on guys jeff back to another video well my beard's getting a lot fuller um starting to come back i just got done shooting the last act of my holiday special the search for the savage sasquatch remastered uh, i think it's going to be a really really dope video um, i'm actually excited to finish it it's going to incorporate a lot of different mediums into the uh into the story and i'm really really excited to finish it up and give it a preview before i put it out around thanksgiving other than that i've got a lot of different things going on right now um, i'm trying to complete some deep sea dive suits to make some deep sea dive sets with some extra parts that i've uh, repaired I've got some scuba sets i'm trying to get a lot of stuff going right now i've been making molds um, to kind of sell some more stuff after the first of the year. I think you guys are going to be really excited to see what I've got coming. I'm going to do a Watson the Shop here pretty soon when I have some more stuff to share with you guys. But, yeah, I've just basically been going through all my old spare G.I. Joe parts and trying to um, figure out what I can do with them to make some cool customs for, uh, for you guys throw out there uh, in the next uh, couple weeks i do have a custom video coming on my multi-use platform which i think you guys are going to like um, the one that i am selling is my prototype that i did for the video it's got an issue with the decal when i when i put the epoxy glaze on it the uh the decal spotted a bit so if you if you're interested in one of these I am gonna put the one from the video on eBay. It has a flaw, but I think it's really, really cool still. So on eBay, you'll be able to see it, the pictures of what I'm talking about better. Um, in the video, I didn't do the epoxy glaze. It's something that I came up with afterwards. I've got about three or four of the multi-use platforms done. Um, I just have to epoxy glaze them. So I'll probably do that sometime after the first of the year. On the GI Joe front, uh, I've got some reviews coming. I've almost finished up all the reviews of the G.I. Joe Collector Club figures, which I'm excited to get those done. And after I'm done with those, I'm going to move on to the G.I. Joe Collector Club convention sets, all the Adventure Team themed ones. So that'll be something for 2022 um, to be on the lookout for. I have some action figure reviews coming up here in the next few weeks. I've got videos done that'll take me until about the first of the year. So I haven't really been spending a lot of time in my workshop um, because just the holidays coming up, Halloween just got here, just haven't had the time I'd really like to have, which is understandable with a three-year-old. So that's what's going on right now. I'm really excited for 2022. Um, I've seen some really cool stuff come from Cotswold on, on the 3D printed front, some of the stuff they've been sharing. So if you're uh, not following Cotswold Collectibles on Instagram or uh, their YouTube channel, definitely check them out. I know a lot of you guys do on Facebook. Uh, all the sites I've mentioned in the past, you know, there's so many now. They're doing great. Uh, Adam from the G.I. Joe Lost Chronicles has shared some really cool customs he's been working on with me. Uh, I think it's going to be a really cool project. Um, lastly, I'm, I'm just really stoked that everybody is pushing each other in the world of customs and the G.I. Joe one six scale community. I think when we see each other's videos, we're always like, damn it, I wish I would have thought of that shit. And uh, I'm really excited for where this is all going. And I hope in 2022, we can continue to push forward and, and just push the hobby to another level. Uh, I love it. I love all the stuff coming out. I love all the customs. I like all the stuff that Cotswold Collectibles doing. It seems like there's a lot of boutique companies popping up that are doing stuff for the GI Joe Adventure team. Uh, yeah, it's just a fun hobby. I'm really enjoying it. I, I'm excited to see what everybody comes up with in the coming years. So I hope you guys are doing great out there. Be on the lookout for some of my videos in the next few weeks. I think you're going to like. And in the meantime, guys, cheers.